All right. I am kind of in shock. The last time we've gotten an update like this in the middle of a testing window was during the pandemic. So for this update to come through today, saying that anyone who is taking a future exam with reference tables, that the coordinator should have printed copies of the paper. I, I can't tell you how upset so many of us teachers are because we spent so much time advocating, sending messages, doing all we could. You know, we thought it was such a big win that we finally convinced College Board to provide paper copies of the periodic table. But why wouldn't you also provide a copy of the reference table? Like that makes no sense at all, right? So for them to go back on this a week into exams, yes, if you're taking the AP physics exam um, later this week, you will absolutely have access to a paper copy of your reference table, which I mean, it's just such a headache to try to have to pull windows open on Blue Book to try to figure that out. And I'm so glad that they recognize this. But what does this mean for everyone who already took the AP chemistry, the AP biology exam? If you want to, this means that you have an opportunity to retake the exam free of charge. So the AP chemistry retake is on May 20th. So it is in eight days. If you want to, and you feel like it caused a lot of havoc, um, if it really stressed you out and you think it impacted your score, you can retake the exam. If you are able to do that, I don't see why anyone would not want to. Do, I mean, obviously, taking the AP exam is a, a major stress, right? There is a lot of stress associated with that. This is a massive exam. It takes a lot of time, um, takes away from other things, right, <laughs> and other aspects of your life. But if you can retake the exam for free after seeing what the new hybrid exam is going to look like, you know, the 2025 FRQs are released and there are so many people out there who have taken the time to show you how to do all of those so you know exactly what to expect. I mean, if if you really are going for that five and you really want to pass, why not retake it, right? If you if you can. Um, unfortunately, I think a lot of seniors are in positions where maybe they've already had their last day of school. I wouldn't want to come back and take an AP exam afterwards either. I get it. Um, but yeah, that's what this update means. So basically, College Board said today that they are allowing proctors to print out all paper reference copies of all of those reference tables. So for example, the AP Physics exam on Friday, AP Physics 1, you will have a printed copy of your um, equation sheet. And that means if you took the chem chemistry exam on Tuesday about a week ago and you didn't have access to it, and let's say Blue Book was not working well because let's face it, does Blue Book ever work well? Well, I don't know. Um, so let's say you're in a situation where you think that really changed and impacted your test taking experience, you can take the retake on May 20th. So that's all we have right now. Um, I just wanted to check in. Let me know how you all, you all are feeling about this. To be honest, I was I was ticked when I saw this update because this is something so many teachers have ad advocated for and I don't understand why we are now changing it. It's like a week too late in my book. Um, but yeah, let me know how you're feeling. I just posted a video trying to <laughs> update as many students as possible. Like, let me know what you're, what you're thinking um, and how you're feeling about this. Know that, as always, I am cheering you on. You know, if you're like, yeah, I'm done with AP Chem. I took the exam. I'm not retaking it. Like, props to you. I, I'm all for that, too. Um, so, yeah. So that's, that's what's up. So if you want to, you can retake the AP Chem exam on May 20th with a paper copy of the formula sheet. Yeah. So, Em, do you recommend retaking the test? It's 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 going to be dependent on your situation, right? Obviously, you're going to have an unfair advantage if you retake the test because they have already released the 2025 FRQs, which looked a little bit different from previous years, right? The test looked different from other years because this was our first time taking a hybrid exam. I think some of the images, like the particle diagrams, even just looked a little bit different. So if you retake the exam, you already have exposure to what to expect. I think you will have an advantage um, if you are really trying for that five. Um, it might be worth it to retake it. But again, if you are a senior, if you are a, if you're just done, like I, I respect that too. Um, but if you want to retake it and it's not 
going to cause too much stress. Um, yeah, I think what I will do is I will probably host a live a week from today. So I just finished. This was my last Chegg live tonight because college is let out a little bit earlier than high school. Sorry, guys. We're, we're close to the end. But we're not there yet. Um, but what I think I will do is I will host a live next Monday and I'll just go through the 2025 FRQ. So if you decide to do, do the retake, I'll do like a quick review of the week, the night of the 19th, um, just to provide some support. But yeah, wild, wild times in the world of AP um, exams. I, I'm like kind of shocked, right? Yeah. What? So Miss A for Chem, what are you going to recommend? Are you going to tell them to retake it? It, it's so hard. If only College Board had just listened to us. And I, if I could share the Facebook group of all the AP chemistry teachers across the country, I promise we have all been pestering College Board for months about this. As soon as we saw, you know, the little practice test in Blue Book, immediately, all of us started reaching out, advocating for you, trying to get both the paper copy of the periodic table and the reference table. And we finally, yes, they are. It's been fun to watch because I can, <laughs> yes, all of your teachers, I promise everyone in the world of AP Chem, like we want the best testing situation for you all. We think you should, in any other situation, any other chemistry exam that you are ever going to take, you will have a paper copy of your reference table. Why wouldn't we provide that for the AP chemistry exam too? Um, so now for us to all be facing this, when you feel like, oh, I took that exam a week ago, I'm done. And now I, I think a lot of students are probably going to be pressured to, to retake the exam because obviously you're going to have an unfair advantage if you have seen the 2025 questions and you have a paper copy of the formula sheet. So I don't know how I feel about this. I just thought I would check in with you all. Um, again, know that we're all here to support you. And I respect your decision, whether you decide to retake it um, or you decide that you're done. And either way, we don't really need to worry about our scores until July, right? So remember this AP chemistry exam, it is just going to be such a small blip in the scheme of things, um, for your life. And yeah, I don't know. I don't know. We're, we're fired up right now for you though. I promise. All right. Hang in there, everyone.